I think it is. <laughs> you must be John. He goes by Joker now. You know who I am? Bruce has mentioned you, yes. Really? What'd you tell him about me? All good things, I hope. Alfred knows you're a friend of mine. And any friend of Batman's? Bruce! I know. We're tight like that. Uh, yes, he informed me. That's great! No secrets between us. We're all part of the club. Wow! The Alfred! I've been collecting tabloid photos of Bruce for years, and you're in the background of at least a third of them. You're hurt. Let me have a look. Ah. Let's get this off you. I'll take care of stapling the wound. Can you? I'll prepare the compress. Can I help, Al? You mind if I call you that? Please don't. And thank you, this is a one-person job. <sighs> I can't disinfect okay. it with that piece still in there. Well, <sighs> this ought to be fun. Listen to you speak all day with that accent. It's like a Dickens <clears throat> novel come to life. I bet it comes in very handy around Christmas. I <sighs> shouldn't close it yet. Might get infected. I'm guessing there's no way this doesn't sting. Does this sound natural? Oi! You there, boy! Get the queen her please! Oh, for damn it! Uh, not well. Your honesty is appreciated. So, Joker. What's up? You've got a new look. Awesome, right? You'd be amazed what you can find in thrift stores, but also on mannequins in fancy stores when no one's looking. Certainly makes an impression. Well, I was aiming for a Batman. But me, dark and scary, like my best bud, but also flashy and fun. <laughs> it finally feels like the right skin. Uh-huh. When you jumped off the bridge, that was one hell of a drop. What happened after? That was crazy, right? <laughs> it seemed like a fast getaway. Terminal velocity and all. Anyway, I hit. Sploosh! And it was dark and cold and wet for a while. Then I ended up grabbing onto some flotsam. Or was it Jensen? No, 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 it was Blossom. Floated on that until I hit the shore, found Frank from the stack deck, and got some dry clothes. Gave me a different outlook, you know? New lease on life. <laughs> Glad it worked out. That looks a lot like a batarang. A batarang? No, I don't even see how you'd think. Uh oh. Yeah, maybe. But, but it isn't. It's totally unique. It's a Joker Ray. Uh-huh. They're really warm. They've been in my pocket all day. I said I'd throw it a hundred times a day, and I did. I'm a real dead-eye now. Um, good work. <laughs> I certainly thought so. I should get back to my arm. Of course. <laughs> I don't want you getting... Few of these should do the job. I'm dying to know what was Bruce <clears throat> like as a type. An oh, angel, perfect in every way. Really? <sighs> yeah, if you discount all this, okay. Terrible. Done. Did. We've had too much practice as of late. <sighs> Guess it's just one of those Wayne luxuries, huh? Having someone like Alfred to take care of you. You're kind of his ward, huh? Do people still use that word? Alfred's always been there for me. 
After my parents died, he became the person I could count on the most. Everything in the line of duty? Sure, Al. You guys are so cute. Alfred, I kind of got hurt in that scuffle, too. Do you think... Um... Oh, come on, it's hardly a... Please. Mm. Damn it, that stinks! <sighs> in, in a really heartfelt, caring kind of way. It's Waller. Batman. We know what you did, Waller. You're gonna regret. Sorry. Sorry. So you're with our mutual friend. Good. It'll make this convenient. I want John Doe. Joker. Sorry. John Doe and the virus. In two hours. Or I go public with your identity. I don't want to burn you down, Bruce. But I will. Don't. Push me, Waller. Your actions are why we find ourselves here. The virus, your joker, at the GCPD. Two hours. She's going to kill me! Kill me or turn me into a slave like Bane! And look what happened to him! I don't want to have some maniac stab Waller me! Waller won't stop coming after you until she gets the virus. But we can't give it to her. We have to destroy it. We do? Why? Not that I'm second-guessing you. You wanted to be a hero. This is how we do it. This is how we keep people safe. With the virus gone, Waller won't see you as much of a threat. Well, I don't like the sound of that. She's going around telling lies, pinning murders on me. She has to pay for what she's done. I could Put just the slightest hint of virus in Waller's shampoo. Or maybe her perfume. Technically, I'd still be giving her the virus. I only want to see her melt. I thought I made it clear. Heroes don't resort to murder to solve their problems. No, but it's so effective. Dr. Leland did say I had trouble letting things go. No issue. So what am I supposed to do? Give up my grudges? What am I gonna lie awake at night stewing over then? Well, at least you're aware of your problem. That's the first step to overcoming it. Uh, I assume the second step is giving you the virus. Well, if you say it's the right thing to do. I'm trusting you on this. Now, right here. That's it? That's it. Completely inert now. Joker, Bruce and I need a moment. Oh, okay. I'll, uh, check the perimeter. I'm relieved to see he listens to you. You can balance him out. Just don't take your eyes off him. Toast is clear. Waller has leverage on me. We need a countermeasure. Perhaps someone on the inside can help. Someone who's lost faith in Waller's crusade. You have someone on the inside? Agent Amon Avesta. She changed her tune about Waller after the raid on the Sanctus facility. If she's looking for a way to fight back, you could give it to her. She's our best bet. Batman. Waller's threatened to reveal my identity if I don't hand over Joker and the virus. I need some information on her. Something to negotiate with. Well, 
You came to the right person. When do you need it? I'm meeting her at the GCPD in two hours. Meet me on the roof in one. I'll have a little present for you. We're taking the Batmobile? We're taking the Batmobile? down Waller. Joker and Batman, heroes of Gotham. <laughs> We're not here for a fight. You need to make yourself scarce. Waller is only a few floors below us. All right, I'll do the dignified thing and hide. So if things go south, I can surprise them from the shadows. <laughs> No, I... I know. I, I just need a place to stay for a little while. It's just... I, I'm sorry, I have to go. I'll call you later, okay? Batman, I'm glad you came. <sighs> Waller's really gonna do it. If you don't give her Joker, she'll shout your identity from the rooftops. I know you said that things were okay between us, but I can't shake the feeling I'm to blame. After the fallout with Harley at the bridge, now this... I'm sorry I told Waller your secret. Let me make it up to you. I found something on Waller. Something big. I threw together a document. Details just how dirty her hands are. Sanctus, the experiments, Riddler. It's a little unbelievable, but it's worse than I thought. When the agency initially dissolved Sanctus, Waller was responsible for cleanup. In public record, she did exactly that. But that isn't what happened. No. She saved samples and data. She just couldn't let it go. Not when it had so much potential. And someone from Sanctus got their hands on it. She's to blame for all of this. If she had just done her job and destroyed the virus, none of this would have happened. Nice work, Amon. I've seen enough. With this in your pocket, Waller loses her leverage over you. Thank you, Amon. I guess it's all over now. It's only a matter of time before Waller realizes what I've done. She'll want to keep this buried, so it's unlikely she'll take this to internal affairs. But that won't stop her from ending my career. Or from making my life a nightmare. Come work with me. We'd be lucky to have you. At Wayne Enterprises? Or should I get fitted for body armor? I'd go with Wayne Enterprises. Better benefits. I might take you up on that. Thank you. Well, it's just you and Waller now. Hopefully the next time I see you, it will be to talk about my salary. Well, well, well. Sorry to interrupt. Not only are you aiding and abetting a wanted criminal, you corrupted one of my most loyal agents. Someone I trusted. Someone I took under my wing. And you did this for what? She works with me now. Right, Avesta? So you won't even try to deny it. You've crossed a line, Batman. You helped that maniac escape with the virus. The virus is destroyed. I saw to it myself. Destroyed? Fine. Well, I don't see John Doe wrapped up in a bow. Are you here to take his place? 
because that's not what I asked for. I'm pretty sure I was clear on that. It's over, Waller. I know what you did. And I was thinking you were here to make peace. They all work for me now. A special task force for special problems. Oh my god. Even your old friend Catwoman. Catwoman? Don't give her anything, Batman. She... <gasps> Did I say you could talk? You're outmatched. Time to stop this foolishness and get back into line. With the rest of the team. You intolerable... <laughs> They don't intimidate me, and neither do you. Then let's go, Bats. Let's see what you got. Oh, you're confident, Batman. But then you'd have to be with the crap you've pulled. This is wrong, Waller. You can't use criminals to do your dirty work. Why should good people die fighting the likes of them? Or the likes of you and John Doe? You put my people in the hospital, protecting a maniac who killed at least three of my agents. A maniac who stabbed me in the gut. You're on the wrong side of this. You have to see that. Don't preach at me, Waller. I know how corrupt you really are. What do you mean? What did she tell you? There's nothing on me I can't handle. Whatever you think you've got will bounce off me like rain off an armored truck. You know why they call me the Wall, Batman? Because you can't. You know if your superiors see this, it destroys your career. <laughs> what do you want? I want you and the Agency out of Gotham, today. Okay. With the virus gone, my work here is done. I'll order my people to pack That's up- That's not all. Don't push it, Batman. I still know your identity. This is a stalemate, not a rout. Let Catwoman go. She helped against the pact. She's not like the others. Oh, please. You're asking me to let a wanted criminal out on the streets? So unlike you. I'll tell you what. You want your little friend? I'll give her to you. On one condition. Hand over Doe. You know he'll be better off locked away. Better for himself and for everyone else. Otherwise, we're even. Me and my people are out of this godforsaken town. Deal. I'll bring him in. Serious? You're really gonna sell me out like that to her? That's not acceptable. Not at all. What the hell? It's John Doe. Oh, put in. Come out, come out, wherever you are. You've got the biggest villain in Gotham right in front of you. And you're giving me up? And letting her waltz out of town? That is so very disappointing. Pointing. I wasn't going to sell you out. Well, it sure seemed that way to me. How about we ask everyone here what they saw? You think you're some kind of force for justice, Joker? Don't you see how ridiculous that is? What's ridiculous is that anyone believes your lies. You blame me for your crimes when we both know you killed Riddler. Are you serious? Think whatever you want. You will never be a hero. How dare you? You're worse than me. That makes me the hero. And this is what heroes do to villains. What are you doing? Doing what you apparently can't. Shining a light on the shadiest part of Gotham. <laughs> Kill him! With pleasure! Yeah! Not yet! The 
agency gave me a little upgrade. What do you think? Sorry, but I think you can handle it. I'm sorry, this damn collar. It's a kill switch. One wrong move and Waller pulls the trigger. I can't risk testing her. Then don't hold back. I can take it. You think so? Thanks. I owe you one. Back off, cat lady! That's enough! You're cornered, Batman! Give up, Joker! Now! Or I'll take you both down! Last chance! <laughs>